Well, from what I'm understanding about the couple in the video is, um, there's kind of like a loner dude. And he comes out of an apartment, kind of run down it seems. Um, his mom's yelling at him, so I'm gonna guess he's type of, he's a kind of rebellious guy. And he flirts around with a bunch of people in New York City. You know how big cities are, there's like, everybody loves everyone. Or everyone hates everyone, it's vice versa. But he finds this one girl who comes along and she's like, oh hey, I'm cool looking, I guess. I mean, she's kind of cool looking, I guess, maybe. Anyways, so then they like end up like becoming a thing and they get married and really, that's kind of what the couple does. So really it's just gonna be a lot of like flirting around and kind of some weird stuff, but I guess I have to do it. The green screen is actually pretty simple if you have an eye to do it. A lot of people try and attempt green screen and in the end it just doesn't look good because they don't really know what they're doing for one or for two they just don't have the talent for it. Um, for green screen what you have to do is stand in front of a green screen literally or in a painted green area. Um, either or works. I prefer walls because there won't be any creases or anything. Um, then you go to your movie editor. It depends on what you have. If you have Mac you might have Final Cut. If you have a Windows computer maybe you have Pinnacle. Um, um, either or, there will always be a luma keyer option. You're going to want to click luma keyer after you import your green screen video and it will take out all of the green in the background depending if you selected the green, maybe you, it's blue screen, there's, there's tons of different things. But um, once you take your green screen, you edit any picture, um, you have to be sure that your green screen layer is on top and the picture is on bottom or else it'll just overlay on top of your imported video. So you have to put it under and voila, it is all done. But be sure to edit with lighting effects or else it looks like you literally just cut out a magazine clipping and you put like some holographic background behind it and it looks stupid. So play with lighting, um, don't be cheesy with it, make it actually look nice and that is how you will successfully make a green screen video.